you should think about what are the features you are which are what are the features you are building what is the feature you are building hello and welcome everyone if you're new to this channel then my name is uh, amit patel and uh, you are watching musings with software engineer if you're new then uh, subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon uh, because on this channel i share ideas insight tools and tactics that can help you grow from where you are in the software industry to an epic level of success so if you're new then subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon let us begin uh, sir i'm studying in bca final year i learned mon stack and android development and i have two projects in both which is uploaded on github now i started competitive programming too okay so sudeep what is competitive programming i don't know what is competitive program because in 23 years of my experience um, i have never done what you call as competitive programming for me programming means uh, you have so you when you are building an application what you are trying to do is you are solving some problem it can be a business problem it can be uh, some kind, if you are building an iot uh, application internet of things application it can be a problem related to certain device that you are controlling using your program okay if you are building a data science application okay then your problem is uh, about using the data to solve some kind of a problem correct so every application you build is to solve this problem okay so there is nothing like you have to write a code in speed and all your code should be good to solve this problem that is what matters okay there is nobody is going to uh, look at how uh, how much speed you have in your coding they will measure how what is the quality of your code and within of course the given timeline if you take too much of time to solve something which means they will understand that you are not very good in programming but i don't understand what is competitive programming okay competitive programming is a marketing term which a lot of this training institutes are using that they are going to teach you competitive programming okay programming is programming programming is a way in which you make your computer do things that you want it to do and nowadays you are making the cloud do the things that you want to do so you are uh you are having some virtual server somewhere in the world and you are writing a program for that virtual server and then that program is an application whatever kind of application whether it's a whatsapp or a facebook or a netflix it does what it is required to do okay so it it you should think about what are the features you are which are what are the features you are building what is the feature you are building for example let's say you you get hired by netflix and one of the feature that you have to build is that from from the past history one month history of this person identify what is the best uh, type of movies this person will like okay so you will look at various things you, whether it's a uh, actor actresses that you watch regularly or the kind of movie whether it's a thriller or a drama or those kinds of things so whatever you do on the basis of that you will write that program you are just solving that problem correct in that there is no competition you are not compete you are always competing with yourself okay so if you are in ba B, bca final year uh, and you already have a github uh, profile for android and i would suggest that if you want to get into programming then after bca first thing is to get a job first thing when you get a job only then you will come to know whether you are competitive or you are not competitive okay so i hope i hope that helps you sudhi i hope you enjoyed this session if you think you are not getting the right salary or promotions you can get the link to my how to become an a player course in the description thank you very much stay focused stay rich and see you in the next live